jewelry box. That's okay. not empty. Is it a gun case? Oh, whoa. Do you see what I see? I see something awesome in the back of this unit. Whoa. We just bought this absolutely loaded storage unit right here out here in beautiful Virginia Beach for only $170 and it is packed from the floor to the ceiling. Let's get in there and see what we got. Mission number one, let's get enough boxes to build a table and save my back. All right. Deal? Deal. <laughs> Ugh. What do you think's in these boxes though? I don't know, hopefully the fact that we see a lot of Christmas at the front is not Christmas. Don't say that. Ugh. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm saying hopefully, oh. <laughs> I was hoping. Hey, it's not Christmas. It's actually though. not though. Okay. Hey, see, take see. that back. Take okay. that throwing box Ooh. at me I'll away. I'll pull it back. All right. Thank you. Here. I'll pour you a cup of tea. Uh, okay. This is, what's it say on here? Silver on copper. So it is some silver on the outside. That's why it looks like that. Silver over copper. What else is in this box? This is really heavy. It says peanuts. What's in there? Not peanuts. What are those? What is this? It looks like it goes with a teapot, maybe? Okay, I don't have the slightest clue on what that thing is. Let's see what else is in this box. Got a couple huge serving trays. Are these speakers over here? Yeah, a couple Vivitar speakers. This guy right here. Get out, get out, stop fighting me. That's a GPS, an old school GPS wow. before everyone had it on their phone. Wow. And this is just this. Ooh, it costs $3. <laughs> so at least it's decor. Was this a purse though? Decor. There's nothing in there. Decor is better than Christmas, right? Right. Look at that. Oh, mini. Oh, wait. I think they're, they're knobs. They're handles, yeah. Yeah, for like a dresser or something. I BS you not. That box that said Christmas and had all decor, this box says decor on it. So if it's all Christmas, man, that's going to be weird. <laughs> oh, let's see. They're trying to troll us. They are. You think it's going to be? Mm, it says decor glass. No, no, it's not Christmas at least. All these things. Why are these so satisfying to look at? Hey, um, Lisa from Avery's all in like this. We have, I think I see a couple more. Look in there. I do. The same thing? Yep. Lisa, if you're watching this. We got you. We got you. <laughs> I'll set it aside for you. Ooh, that looks interesting. First, let's look at these. These are just a couple of frames, home decor pieces. Is this like... Well, we are like literally, I think, Ooh. five minutes from the beach. So this kind of stuff here doesn't surprise me. Fancy. That's cool. Look at that. That is cool. And it's got a little glass yeah. base on it. What does it say on the bottom? Does it say something? It's just where they got it from. It's oh. only 15 bucks, $20, but yeah, that's cool. it looks cool. And just because it has a price tag, it said something on it. It doesn't mean stuff doesn't go up and down. It's not older, so you can't really judge those. This thing... What the heck's in there? I wouldn't even try to pull that out. I'm not. I feel like it's gonna bite me. <laughs> What's this? Is this frame? Uh, oh look, it's like a little oh. made 3D thing. It looks like some type of oh, like Asian paper? village yeah. type thing. That's pretty cool. Set it down here. What else do we got? Oh, look at this old car. Oh, what the heck, it plugs in. What? What does it do? What, what is the heck this? is that? Okay, you got me at a loss right here. Somebody out there. What? I'm so confused. What, what could this even do? Do you have a guess? <laughs> I have no I'm idea. I'm trying to like come to my head so I can edit it and make it look like I know a little bit, but no. No, not, not a clue. Some glasses, more glasses. This over here is a shelf. Before I get into that, that's what looks interesting. What was this? Sharper image. Color changing candles. Why not just get real candles? Mm. Alright, what is colors. This? An old Ooh, Barbie, Barbie doll, doll truck. truck. What year is that? 1963. Hmm. It's in pretty good shape for that age. Yeah, it is. Let's see if it's got clothes in it. That's what it had last time I found one. Ooh, uh, that's really good. This is probably the best condition Barbie box we've found. By far. It doesn't have anything in it, but that doesn't mean it's not somewhere else in there. But the box's condition itself is pretty cool. That's definitely worth something to a collector. I just noticed something that actually made me a little bit more excited for the unit. So I went to see what was in this hat. 
And notice these are the tags they hand out to GameStop employees. Trust me, I go there way too much. I know what they wear. So hoping this person works at GameStop. And if so, usually GameStop only hires people that are into the stuff they sell. So if they have gaming collectible stuff, I'm gonna be in a good mood. Hey, who needs 80 rolls of Christmas wrapping paper in the we middle might. of April? We, well, we, yeah, not not now, but <laughs> <laughs> we might use it. I think I see a sporting bag in here too, but I don't know how we're gonna quite get to it yet. What should I go for next? Should I try to get this mist box. Um, sure. Let's get the mist box. Ugh, don't fall, please. Well, the mist box is heavy. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's heavy, all right. I'm having some difficulties out here. What? <laughs> the wrapping paper was almost falling. Oh, sorry. And I didn't have you in frame for a second. <laughs> all right. This isn't Mist. a good strategy, is it? <laughs> okay. Oh, wow. Uh, oh, not clothes. Oh, there's stuff in there. Look. Like an old lantern, for one. Okay. Check out that. That's pretty cool. It definitely looks old. It doesn't have any markings on it, which to me is a good sign. Oh, there it is. It says Glow Brand something. Not sure. Not really familiar with lanterns. <laughs> That's kind of a weird expertise. Ooh, you know what these are usually used for? From my experience, is autographed posters. That's what they come in, are these kind of tubes. And there's something wrapped up in there. Well, it's some artwork. Which may or not, may not be worth something. And it's a different name than what's on the game. I always try to pay attention to weird stuff like that, you know? Try to match the names up, but that name is different from that name, so that's kind of strange. We got like a bunch of perches, all empty. Another open thing, what is this? Is that all the candle wax stuff? Shade butter soap. Oh, look at that. Still. Yeah. Melt it down. Another teapot thing. This one looks more sparkly. Is there any markings that say this is sterling silver? Not that I'm seeing. But look how much you could tell the difference in that one, I think. It's a lot shinier. What else we got in the box? Nothing. Nothing. Empty frame. Anything in this thing? Ooh, there's something in there, all right. What's that? A little plate. You see it? A little plate. What's this? Is that a fishing pole? Cool. There's a couple other, oh, I'm so scared of hooks when I see that. You see that already? Yeah. That hook just floating around waiting to grab me. There's a Daiwa reel in here. Another little reel in here. And, oh, you see, oh, never, I thought that was a scope. I thought for sure that was a scope, but it looks to be fishing stuff in here. And I see what might be a tackle box. Stop, the hook keeps grabbing the box. Go back in the bag like you're supposed to. <laughs> Thank you. I see this is what I'm assuming is gonna be a tackle box full of fishing stuff, right? Oh yeah, who would have guessed? Look at that, we got some fishing lures, not lures, lures, lures. And then we have, oh yeah, a whole bunch of fishing stuff in here. This will probably definitely be a live auction lot, minus the case, because the case is gonna be too big to ship out. But we'll see, a lot of fishing stuff there. I see, look, in the box right there, an orange thing that looks like it has more Brand fishing new. stuff in it. Is it? Oh, it is. Look at that. It's like a little kit that has a bunch of everything you can need to fish. What's that? Just a pot. What's this bag? Nothing. There's a couple weird things over here. These actual glasses. Let's see. Yeah, glasses. So if they're a name or a prescription, they just get donated from us. Is this Jenga? A weird kind of. Jenga. More fishing. Ooh, look what I see. A Nokia. But I'm not really excited about it. It'll only be worth about five bucks in parts. But what it does is it tells me the story of the person. I can find out all kinds of information. Little pair of headphones. Ew. Ew. These are the people that leave dislikes on the video. 100% that's what you look like. Don't lie. Can I point out something else I like about this unit? Two locks on the floor. Every time I see more than one, I love that because that means whoever owned it tried to save it. And if they tried to save it versus just letting it go, that's usually a better sign there's something in there worth a little something. So like to see the multiple locks. Let's start pulling from over here. There's the hat with the GameStop badges. That's Employee. a magic hat. This is? Yeah, it has a little that? hole in the bottom. Oh, wow. You're telling me all this time these magicians weren't actually pulling <laughs> rabbits out of there? Nope. Wow, my whole it. life just got ruined. <laughs> Let's get this down. What is that back there? I don't know, I'll figure it out. Uh, let's see, another bag. Is this a bag, come? a bag? No, I thought so. Here's like a little prayer frame, some sunglasses. What's that? A little teacup, they really like teacups in there. 
a snowman ornament, anything in the elephant bag, just a giant plate. This is all just kind of random like decor kitchenware stuff. So I was trying to pull this shelf out of here. This box came down, I think it's empty, but you know, I gotta make sure they didn't put nothing else in it. Is it just the paperwork? Yeah, it's unfortunately just the paperwork, so just jump. Had to open it on camera just in case I open it up, it's full of money or something. You had to see it too. Let's see what this is. This is what I wanted to get out of here. So do you think this goes with this? I do. So to make like one giant shelf, we might use it. Yeah. Maybe. We need stuff like this for the basement, don't we? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Wouldn't hurt. Let's get this guy out. Ooh. What is in here? Looks like a weird combination of sports and kitchen. I see a basketball jersey. Well, it looks like a basketball jersey. Paul, it's new. It. 70 bucks right there. That's new, unused. That's good. Let's see. A what? What is this supposed to be? Maybe it's a chalkboard? I don't know. Read the <laughs> back. You. What's it say? Hobby Lobby. Hey, you're right, chalkboard. <laughs> Look at you knowing this weird stuff. I would've like, uh, thought that was smart. like a disabled picture frame. <laughs> Disabled picture frame. I didn't know. Ooh, what's in here? I like these kind of things. These either really good or really gross. There's usually no in between. What do you think it is? I don't know. It's a massager. Ah, okay. Phew. <laughs> what else is in here? This, it says raincoat? It doesn't feel like a raincoat, but all right. You say so. Little candle thing. This guy. What is that? Not too sure, huh? So a lot of random stuff in here. Is that jewelry? No, it's office clips. What about the vase? Uh, this looks like office stuff. office stuff. Boo! Before I get this box out, make sure you take a split second and leave the video a thumbs up because it helps us out a lot. And please don't fall stuff. And of course, subscribe if you are new. Let's see what's in this one. Um, this looks very random as well, doesn't it? Yeah. What is this? A seahorse. Sea horse. All right, Ready. cool little decoration piece. This right here, a painting. Nice. It looks pretty good. Done by somebody. You never know with art if like they're buying this from a museum or they're the self are just artists and they keep it all. So you never really know. Is this brand new wow. baby clothes? Like a whole bag of brand new baby clothes. Right there. Christmas thingy. What else is in here? Another pair of glasses. Nope, just the, what does that say? Blue light, Blue light. blocking. Oh. Blue light blocking glasses, I guess that's a thing. Ooh, is that a coin? What is that? Nothing. What could this be used for? I feel like we can find something to use this for. I don't know. I don't know either. Let's see, anything in the box? Little miniature ornaments, look how tiny those are. Could be collector pieces. This, like a, I don't even have a, a fan? Looks like a fan of some sort. Is this a DS or a Nintendo charger? It looks like it, yes, doesn't it? It does. Looks like a DS charger. It does. Let's see if we can find the DS in here. I'm not seeing it. More baby stuff, brand new. Right here, too. Yeah, look at that. This too? Brand new. Brand new. Bunch of brand new baby stuff. It makes you wonder what happened. And is this a Funko? Uh, I can't <laughs> get him out. Get out of there. Yep. A wrestler. wrestler, who is that? Ah, uh, who does that look like? No one I recognize. No. Nope. I don't know. I tried. <laughs> Maybe, I, this, I hope that when you say that to yourself, it will just come to you. Maybe. Look at that, earplugs. Nothing else that I'm seeing in here. Are these some stickers? Some Avenger stickers. A little envelope, nothing in it. And another little envelope with nothing in it. This is an instant minus 10 respect for this person. All you Cowboys fans out there, no, I'm just kidding. I still like you, but they do suck. Let's see what's in this bag. Just to be honest with you, I don't even watch football. I haven't watched it in years. Hello Kitty right there. Uh, a shoe. And we're just going to act like that doesn't exist. I didn't just touch <laughs> it with my bare hands. That didn't happen. Remember? Nope. Raise your memory. It didn't happen. All right. What about this? this is jewelry box? Mm, looks like Ooh, it. It sounds like something's in there. What do you think? Jewelry box or a picture box? Nothing. Oop. Nothing. One little thingy in there. What is that? It's like a hook. Yeah. <laughs> no actual earrings on it. So does this come down? Look at that. You see that moving? Yeah. 
I don't know if it's broken or it's supposed to come down. I don't hear nothing up there, but we'll definitely look into that. Meh. What's in the purple? This. Let's That's see. not empty. What? Let's see. Let's see. What are you? Get out. Get out. Something's in there. Come out. Uh. Mm -hmm. A little octopus. A little treasure chest. A treasure chest. Yes. Is it open? Oh, it doesn't. Oh, oh. it's got one die oh. in it. Okay. And a bunch of little sea animals. Okay. I love finding. I love storage units. You know, it's just so random to see what other people have. I think it's interesting. Tongs. Okay. A file. I think a handle to a tote. <laughs> That's what it looks like. Now I'm getting to the point where I'm like, I don't know where to grab from. Top. Let's get this out here. Grab that, from the top. That big box? No, I maybe mean, just whatever's on the top. Look at this. This old little antique rocking horse here. It's made out of wood, by the way. Uh, I don't see a year, a date, a make, or anything. I almost feel like it's home bait. I don't know. Could be. Let's see. Let's set him down here. Stay. Grab from where? Just anything that you can reach on the top. Uh, this thing? That's all I'm saying. Uh, come here. Come here. Uh, okay. This. I feel like it's going to be close. No, it looks like kitchen actually. This looks like kitchen here in a purse. Think anything's in a purse? Like a million dollars or a gift card or a couple hundred dollars? Hopefully. Nothing. It's empty. Let's, is this all St. Patrick's Day stuff? Look, you got glasses, you got the napkins, the clothes. It's all St. Patrick's Day in clothes. This box here. I think it's brand new, like a gift box brand or something. Brand new picture box. Oh, picture box. It looks like a shoe box to me, but whatever you want to call it, I guess. It's a box. I think I can maybe reach that box. What do you think? Mm, you have long arms. Yeah, but oh, it's heavy. Oh. It's really heavy. We're going to leave it right now. All right. Let's get these rackets out. I see a few tennis rackets. One, two, one in the case. I see a few more, too. That's not it. Ugh. Another one in the case. Uh, I know nothing about tennis. I know Wilson's the brand on all the tennis balls, so that's about all I know. These are both Wilson, they're all Wilson brand, so are Wilson brand tennis rackets expensive? Let me know down in the comments below. I'll leave that there. Let's get into this pretty colored bag. Something in there looks really old. What is that? Just a pan? A bowl? Is it a bowl? Whatever it is, it's old as you know what. And these are green plastic ones that look like the same thing. What does it say? The gold catcher. Oh, is this gold panning? Whoa. Oh, look. You see that on the side, maybe? Super pan. These, yeah, I think these are gold panning things. The gold catcher. These might be these some really ones. antique ones, yeah. There's nothing on it. If there is, it's definitely unreadable at this point in its life, but that could be antique gold mining stuff. That's a first for us. Look at this little chair here. Ugh, come on out of here. It's pretty small, but I like this color. What would you call this? Like aquamarine? Yeah. Aquamarine? Ha. Aqu <laughs> huh. Well, aquamarine, aka aquamarine. teal. All right, that works too. <laughs> Fine, we'll go with teal. That's boring. No, that's, I would say boring. that's aquamarine. What's in here? This is heavy. Um, What do we got? What do we got? Are those books and exercise bands? These are exercise bands, and these are... Oh, that's like a body revolution, weight loss, yeah, Jillian Michaels thing. I'll change your life in just 30 days. And it has like the pictures on the screen where this guy is like 800 pounds and this guy is like 150. Only 30 days. Half the time, different hairstyles, different skin colors, everything. Those things are such scams. Check out this pair so far. I think they're like outdoorsy chairs and they're really nice and really sturdy. There's two of them so far. Hoping maybe there's more set of four and a table inside there. Maybe, I don't see it yet, but fingers crossed. Let's get this black bag. It looks like a sports bag. Before I go in it, guys, if you made it this far in the video, go down in the comments, leave a comment saying, I can't believe that was in there or no way. One of those two, no way or I can't believe that was in there. Please, I'd like to see who makes it this far into the video. Uh, you should know what this is, right? Softball. You have a little experience? I like the yellow one, a little bit. What are these? What do these have to do with softball? I don't know. Okay. It, it uh, grip strength. Oh, uh, maybe. <laughs> There's a glove. Here you go. Yay! There's the yellow one. There's another one, actually. Ah, I like A couple of yellow better. ones. <laughs> we got, what's Green Day? That brings back memories. I didn't listen to them, but like everybody did. I just remember that name, Green Day. Was that signed? What? The Green Day CD. Was it? If it was, it's really bad. And it's like faded. Nah. 
can't tell. I think crown. The heck? All right, what else is in here? A trophy for a Roman gladiator? What? Okay, this is kind of old. Nice condition to be from the Roman gladiator days. Uh, what else is in here? Another one of these things. Quite a few of them, huh? Yeah. What's this? You know what I thought this was? Mm. Who remembers that obnoxious commercial? What was it called? Head on. Head on. Apply directly to your forehead. <laughs> Head, Head on. on. <laughs> oh my gosh. I thought that's what it was. So there's pockets around the side of this bag. Let's see what's in there. What's this thing? Little Tablet case. case? Yeah. Any other pockets? Um, no, that was the only one. I have to admit right now, I feel just a tad bit blind. I was like, I don't see that table in there. Hopefully we find it somewhere. You don't see that table in there, huh, me? Really? It's sitting right center in the front and I didn't see it? Shows how much attention I pay, right? Let's right. pull this guy out. Ugh. This one says Halloween, but the one that said Christmas didn't have Christmas, so doesn't necessarily mean it's right. Let's see, open up. What the heck, are these all water guns? A bunch of little like party favor water guns is what it looks like to me. Empty, empty. It smells weird. What? It smells weird. Look at that. Copper. It smells like old. Best way to describe it. What do you think's in here? Coleman. Cool stuff. It's like ice pack. Alright. Blankets. Yeah, this totes like the dirty work tote, I guess. There's always one in every unit. So we move that thing. This bag came tumbling down. And what is that in there? Thread. Thread. A bunch of thread. Uh, McDonald's toy. Uh, some type of NASCAR Hot Wheel from Mark Martin. Well, it's got Batman on it. You see that? It's got Batman on the car. Cool. And other than that, there's a bunch of ribbons. So I didn't really know what was in there because it came tumbling on my head. Um, I think now maybe you think I can probably grab those boxes up there. Probably. All right, let's try. All right, I got it. Look what it says on the side. Toys. What if it's all Dragon Ball? I hope so. Let's see. <laughs> you know how cool that would be. One day. One day. Open up you. I was waiting for a toys box. It's always a gamble. It's either like good collectible toys or like those cheap toys you buy for your little kids that they destroy and then for some reason people hang on to. What do you think? I think they're good toys. All right. Ooh, it kind of does look that way. Let's see. Some Paw Patrol stickers. It looks like a combination of the two. This right here is the Hunger Games District of Game, a strategy game, so board game. Yeah, I see some good like action figures down here. At least it looks like it. Caterpillar, a fan. What are they two? Oh, it's got a Toys R Us tag on it. Chicken yeah. Run. Oh my gosh, you remember this movie? I do. There's two figures from that. that. That could definitely be collectible. The movie's old, and as we all sadly know, Toys R Us is gone. Is it all Chicken Run? Look at this. More Chicken Run action figures. Nice. Man, that's cool. <laughs> I like. I forgot that movie existed until I just saw that. And then it instantly made me remember. Like Leapfrog, a rock rowing kit. What else do we got in here? Randomness. What is this Monopoly game here? Is this the one Brandon like just bought like a day it's ago? It's definitely a Monopoly deal, but that might be, it says millionaire on it. It might be just a version. Okay. Battleship, a Star Wars Lego kit. Let's see what's in here. Open up bag. Up oh, some like looks like Disney princess blocks. Let's see. I see some other stuff down there. Oh, Funko set of who? Baby Yoda, the child. Um, let's see. Superman headphones, which is cool. Yeah, I see a bunch of miniature ones like these. Really little ones. So that's kind of cool collectible stuff. What's this? Spectre gadget or just secret agent stuff? Secret agent that. So that was actually a pretty cool box. A lot of collectible things in there. Kind of gets me excited for what else can be in the other one. Now I got the other box that was on top of that one. Oof. Don't look in that hole. Because I don't know what's in there. And I don't want you to spoil it for me. Let's see if I can rip the tape off though. That's step number one. Uh, a message on the side. What's it say? Why? You are asking me to be honest. Uh, what's that say there? Ah, oh, does that say glass? Yeah. No. Let's see. It looks kind of like kitchen stuff. Is that a jewelry box though? Penelope Jewelry.com. Aw, oh, nothing in it. 
This, a water speaker. Remember when these were like insanely popular for some reason? It makes the water dance with the music. Yeah. A couple of miniature light bulbs. We might need those. We might need them. Mr. Clean. Get out. Like a squeegee thing. I see one of those like serving tray, serving trays that might be silver down here. Like, get to it. These. That definitely looks like it could potentially be silver. The bottom half of it's down here and I can't pull it out. Ugh. Whatever, we had to get to it. Let's see if it's marked anything anywhere. I don't see any anything, do you? Not from here. I don't see any markings on that. That sucks, so we don't really know if it's silver or not. But yeah, other than that, not seeing too much. This looks like the kitchen junk drawer, basically. So I was finally able to move this wooden box out of the middle of the unit. We got enough stuff out of the way. We got a couple water things, some rocks. Ooh, what's that? Imperial tubing toolkit. That looks really old and beyond my skill set. What else is down here? Is that another tool set? Is it a gun case? Mm -hmm. What do you think it is? Open it. I'm trying. It's like not trying to open. Oh, there we go. What in the heck is that? Intensity. Psh, yeah, I don't know either. <laughs> That's weird. What else is in this little box here? Some party decor. Um, what is this big thing down here? What the heck? I thought this was a dog leash at That's first. That's what it looks like. A dog leash with a flashlight. Flashlight? Okay. That's just the- Ooh. Dang it. There's gotta be a jewelry box in this unit somewhere that has all this stuff. Oh! Whoa! Do you see what I see? Ooh. A whole box of these 1990 NHL hockey cards. There's a the top to the box. Ooh, is there more in there? Uh, doesn't look like it, but that's pretty cool so far. I'm trying to peek my way in here without making a huge mess. See if I see any more cards. But no, I don't. It looks to be, to be that one box. So I just pulled this out of here, and this is actually an emergency protective order because of family abuse, which is kind of sad, but obviously I don't want to give you the name, but just so you know, I'm not lying to you. Emergency protective order right there for family abuse. So it doesn't really specify what happened But it does specify that somebody it was pretty much a restraining order. Oh, here's the whole thing Yeah, somebody got beat up threatened and then punched in the face when I first saw this in the back It looked like a computer box to me, but now that I got it here it's some type of shoes Kayleen There they are and you know they're pretty much brand new. Yeah, <laughs> this is a broken ankle waiting to happen now, but Let's hope the brand's expensive. Kayleen, I've never heard of that. Every time I think I start to know something in storage units, I find something else that tells me that I really don't know anything yet. I think this is a big bag of purses, I think. Let's see if that's all that's in there, because it feels so heavy. One purse, two purse, three purses, four purses, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, man, like, 15 or so purses. If you guys want a purse lot in the live auction, let us know down in the comments. If not, they'll probably go to our yard sale. So if enough people want it, say it. Let's get this blue suitcase out of here. Next. Ugh. This is a big boy. Is it open? No. No. Was it attached to it? <laughs> I couldn't see the other side. I just heard something go. I kept grabbing. All right, where is the zipper here? Here's one of them. Let's open the top first, I guess. You just closed it. Well, I'm smart. I'm, I should do it. get a new job, huh? No, I'm not. All right, let's open. You all right? Yeah. Second section here. Yep. Oh, whoa, I see a lot of coach though. Something Junior Burt. Oh, nice. Let's see what's in the wallet really quick. Nothing, but these might be the nicer ones. This is another wallet right here, isn't it? Look at all these wallets. They all seem empty, but look, we got that's coach. Um, this one's don't know. Is that coach too? I'm not the person to be judging purses. Yeah, I don't know. But you're right. DB's Dooney and Burke, right? Yeah. It's got the tag on it. So this is just a bunch more purses down here. Look at that. Feel that. It's got like actual fur on it. What does that say? I don't know. Meech. Mish. Huh. 
got a bunch of stuff in here, that's for sure. Everything, well, some of these like wallets and stuff still have like the fabric in it when you first buy it. So it's like they just got them and stored them, which is kind of weird. But this whole bag is also purses. So we gotta be up to like 25, 30 purses right now. I see something awesome in the back of this unit. Look what I found. Bang. Whoa. Sega Genesis flashback. This feels like it's in there. Ooh, look at that. Nice. 64 bit Sega Genesis flashback. These aren't really expensive. They're basically, if you don't know what they are, they're basically new editions of old consoles so they can play on modern TVs and stuff. But look at all the games it has on it. Honestly, this might be a keeper. Yeah, it might be. There's a lot of cool old games on there that I remember. So that's pretty sick. I was hoping that would be in there. We saw the GameStop thing, and there had to be something gaming eventually. So let's keep pulling from the back. Is this a cupcake tin, maybe? Yeah. I guess we'll call it that. This, ugh, there's so much stuff in the back, it's hard to get it. Stuff. Good. There's stuff. Let's see what this is right here. Is this all new clothes? How do I get to the freaking, just like that, right? It's one way to do it. Apple keyboard. But let's see, are these all new shirts? They literally are. It's like a bunch of the same exact ones too. Hmm. They're 12 bucks a piece. They're from Target. Look, there's a whole bunch more. They're all brand new with tags still. Another whole set. All the new clothes is weird. Whoa. Whoa, look at that. That looks awesome. It's got like a little pearl set on it. What's the tag say? Can you Timeless see it? Timeless treasures, gifts from the heart. Made in the Philippines. Oh, that's cool. So there's that, and then there's just a crap ton of new clothes in here. Just a ton. Look at the little globe. That's weird looking, actually. So there's that. What's in this yellow bag over here? Let's see if I can put these back in there. That's a adapter, just a wire adapter. But there's something under here. This is what's intriguing me. Bunch of wires with nothing they really go to. They're just there. Underneath of it, ooh, there's broken glass in there. I don't wanna reach my hand in there. But still, I mean, it's gotta be a hundred plus bucks of brand new clothes at least. I was about to pull this out, but the top came right off of it. You got a Virginia Tech something. I don't really know, look, it's got a hole in the bottom. I got you some flowers. Thanks. <laughs> uh, Airwick and a book. So this, nah, not really cool. The thing itself, the top probably just clicks back on, so it might be fine. I see guitars. Look at this. Guitar Hero. Did that say Gibson? Yeah. They make Gibson like Guitar Hero. So I see the Xbox logo there. So it's for the um, Xbox 360 Guitar Hero on the back. I think I see two of them. Let's see. Yep, the other one's stuck. There's two of the exact same one. I didn't even know they made Gibson model Xbox controllers. What's in here? Is that an animal? What is this? This? There you go. I look good? <laughs> you do. Thank you, thank you. What is that? A little rabbit. And it looks like a bunch of those little like things you hang around your house. Enjoy your life. Ooh, what's that though? Is that makeup? Is it? It looks like it. Ew. I was hoping jewelry. And more makeup. Boo, we don't want makeup and we don't want this particular rabbit. What do you think this giant blue net on this wooden pole is for exactly? I, I don't even have a guess. I don't have a guess either. At first I was gonna say it's a fishing net, but then I see the wooden pole, I'm like, okay, you wouldn't put uh, wood in the water over and over again, so it's not that. Let's get this book bag right here. What do you think's in this one? What do you think is in there? I don't know. <laughs> you never asked me. <laughs> well, I just did. Um, stuffed animals. All right. Oh, look at that, I was right. Oh, what? I didn't peek. Uh, and a stocking. It's, no, it's not even stuffed animals. I looked at it and still got it wrong. They're all stockings for some reason. It's like animal stockings and things like that. So I pulled this little thing out from between the table. I got a drink for you, a Dr. Thunder. Dr. Thunder. Ooh, I see a jewelry box. And here's the more of these things that we were talking about earlier in the video. Plus a bigger guy right there. Three of them. Let's see what's in there. Ooh, a bag. It's empty. Empty. Boom. Dang it. The this. strings look like something. It did. There's another bag, it's empty. What is this? A mushroom, I hope. Um, this right here, is that jewelry? 
Looks like a dog chain to me, but maybe somebody would wear this. I don't know. Let's see what's in the giant pot. I see like a violin, I think. Or like a miniature guitar that doesn't have any strings in it. It says Hawaii is a ukulele. Oh, ukulele. <laughs> My bad. Where does it say Hawaii? Right here. Oh, okay, you're right. Ukulele? I stand corrected. <laughs> Man, that looks like an urn. It does. Straight looks like an urn. An air thin antenna. A fake plant. Ooh, I see some boxes down here though. What is this? Does this go with the urn thing? A shower. Oh, it's a shower head. <laughs> it looks like it, don't they look like similar colors though? Yeah. At first glance. Looks like they could have gone together. Let's put that down here. What's in the big snowman box? What you got for me, Frosty? Uh, tissue paper and what is that? Spray glitter. Oh my gosh, that is just awful to have in a household. Once you do that, you just basically gotta move. This is a shelf. And the other thing in here is a silverware set like this. So nothing special, unfortunately. Ew. This tote is so heavy. Let's see what's inside of it. Is that a recliner or an ottoman in there? I don't know what that is. That's something. What is this? A pocket watch, Ryan World road trip. Not in there. You see what I see though? DS. Remember we said we saw this DS charger earlier. Ninja Turtle game's not in there, unfortunately. Uh, where do I go from here? Let's see what's in here. Some lotion, little box, nothing. This one here is a birthday bag. More new clothes. Man, the amount of new clothes we found in this unit is kind of crazy. Oh, a loot bag. Give me the loot. Uh, bags. What is this? A bird? I thought it was a rabbit. Doesn't it look like it could be a rabbit that way, too? Yeah. <laughs> All right, in here, we got frames. We have jumper cables, and I'm just gonna dump it out. I don't wanna see. Let's see what else is in there. Beanie Babies, our favorite, huh? Mm -hmm. Is this the Princess Diana one? Isn't it a red, pink Purple. one? Purple. Purple, okay. Ooh, a treasure chest. What do you think's in there? Open. Oh, what is that? That little thing? All right. Music box. Okay. Anything else in here? A Maryland license plate. Look what I see down here. That looks like video games to me. What's this first? Ooh, the Witcher Enhanced Edition for Windows. That's in there. These look like PlayStation 3 games. Maybe that means there's a console somewhere. I knew there had to be gaming stuff when I saw that lanyard. Little Big Planet. That's in there. Ooh, Sims 3, fun game. That's in there. Little Big Planet 2. That's in there. One of the most popular games in the world that I've just never been able to get into. Minecraft is in there. Rio, oh, there it is. Get back in your spot. Rio, Disney Infinity. Boom. I think we got a flawless victory, didn't we? Yep. Infinity and, ooh, flawless victory. And that's literally all that's in there. So now let's find that console, man. So I got a really heavy Christmas tree stand, and I'm just not going to go into detail or talk about the shape of this elf thing right here because it's Santa. Just, this is a family friendly channel. We're not going to talk about what it looks like. Let's just get it packed up. Here's another brand of those or another box of those branded Kayleen shoes. Gross. Those are also gross, but they're, these are actually used though. The other ones look brand new, but still, I still have no idea if that's a good brand or a cheap brand or not. I guess we'll find out when I'm editing this. You guys probably already know by now. I'll probably edit it in. This is a pillow. What's it say? Home sweet home. Home sweet home. We got this fabric. This is like a big drinky thing. Big drinky thing. Watch that. A flashlight, an umbrella, and an empty lighter container. It's so random. Hey, do you trust me? I do, yes. Can you just stick your hand out and shake hands with me? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I wanted you to think it would be something gross. Is that what you're expecting at least? I, I, I don't know. You don't know <laughs> what you were expecting? No, I didn't have time to think about it. All right, look. Well, I'll give you this instead. Here's some wood for you. Oh, boy. You're welcome. But now I think I can get this blue half toed out and see what's inside this guy. Ooh. There's a little bell. Ding-a-ling-ling. <laughs> Let's see what's in there. There's the actual Halloween stuff. Now, this is Valentine's. This is Halloween. That's Valentine's. Um, oh, it's one of these satisfying eggs. <gasps> no way, it's not what's in there. What is that? That's like the holder for it. Oh. Dang it. But look at these eggs. Whoa. Whoa! There's so many. Holy crap.
crap. Those that, are the really heavy ones too. Yeah, that's a lot. These are expensive. That's awesome. There's like probably 15 of those suckers in there. Nice. Awesome. Let's see what's on the other side, if anything. Hey, there it is. DSi. The DSi. What game's in there? It is Sonic. We knew this would be in here somewhere. Little DSi. Um, it's got, what is that? Is that a game case? I think it's a game case. Yeah, it is. We got gardening and Imagine Artist. There's another game. Is it? Oh yeah, there's another one there. What's that one? Dogs Talent Show. Pet. Here's another one too. And there's another one, Dogs and Cats. Hey, we knew this would be in here. Called it. Saw the GameStop lander. We knew there had to be gaming stuff in there eventually. What's this? Not too sure. That's a lighter? It looks like a lighter, doesn't it? Yeah. I don't know what that is, but that's an expensive tote. There's a human head in here. Look at this. A very heavy one. What does this go to? I guarantee hold this. You will not expect this weight. Just put one hand out and try to hold it. You ready? Yeah. Oh, whoa. <laughs> I thought you were joking with that. I thought no. I was going to grab it and it was going to be super light. No, this thing is insanely Why heavy. It's that? hollow too. It. It's hollow. It's not even full. I don't know what this thing's made of, but it's insanely heavy. There's that. Let's get the tote that it was in. I think I see trail cameras for hunters. We might keep these for our house. Not to hunt with, but just to see what we see out there. <gasps> no, no, an empty box of ammunition. <sighs> well, that's getting me a little more excited. Same with the hunting stuff. Is that what that is too? Mosquito repellent. This is all hunting stuff in here. Ooh, we look more fishing stuff. This is mosquito repellent again. Ooh, this is getting me excited, guys. There's still three, at least three or four totes I haven't got into yet, at least. I got the tote that was directly under that tote. Is this where all the ammo's at? Yes. Let's see it. <gasps> Don't open it that no, way. It's not. But look, Ooh. more freaking purses. Well, whatever's in here is shattered, unfortunately. Um. Another purse, what's that? What hmm. the heck is that supposed to be? Nope. I don't know either. These are what this, oh no, I thought it was those things like fancy purses came in. Is that an actual coach? What do you think, you think we could find? Ugh, it's moldy. So probably not worth it anyway. No. Well, let's see, not sure what that is. Oh, but look, I see the coach tag on it. So that we'll see if that cleans up or whatnot. But other than that, this whole thing is purses. Looks like a, we got a little miniature Kenmore shop vac type thing. I guess you'd call it a shop vac. And it looks like one of those robotic vacuums. Isn't that what this looks like right here? Yeah. If that's a robotic vacuum, I don't know why I'd be so happy. I feel like they'd be so fun to play with the cats. Let's see. Is that what it is? It's definitely something like that. Is there wheels? Yeah. Oh, that's a, it is! A little robot vacuum. You know what? I saw a video before. Someone said this is the best home defense. They got a fake Claymore mine, stuck it on here, and then had their house speakers play Welcome to the Jungle. There's an intruder. You just press a button. This thing starts flying around the living room with the Claymores playing Welcome to the Jungle. <laughs> I bet you leave that house fast. This tote looks like it's gonna be all closed, but let's pick it up. I see a Gator's wallet. Anything in this wallet? No, unfortunately not. Got a purse, got a bunch of clothes. Yeah, I think we're accurate on this one. This one looks like it's nothing but clothes. If I were you, I wouldn't mess with me with what I just found in the back of the unit. What is it? It's a weapon. A if bat. You want it to be a weapon. I guess we found the balls, found the glove. Well, Inevitably, we're gonna find the bat in the back. That's a baseball bat. But, what's the difference? The, between a baseball and a softball bat? Yeah. The baseball's shorter up here and fatter. Softballs are, or softball bats like long and slim. One more little box in this corner. Ugh. Ooh, and I like what I see. Uh oh. I think that was supporting all this. Uh oh. Yeah. No. no, it's staying. It's staying. It's staying. I see Pokemon though. That's why I'm excited. Can I just point out, whoever got the Pokemon cards at our last yard sale, you got lucky. I made a mistake. Those weren't meant to be out there, but you know, fair play to you. So, uh, these lick a tongue. A few newer Pokemon cards. We realized it and I was like, well, we sold our Pokemon cards for a dollar. Oh well, hope we make money on them. What is this? That's a gun, right? Obviously. It'd be a really weird shaped one, but. <laughs> what the heck is that? Watchman. A watchman. Set that over here. 
There's like a bunch of tiles in here for some reason. I'm trying to get around the tiles and see if there's anything else buried. But I'm not seeing much. It's like all tiles and tape. Blech. So I just lifted this extremely heavy tote, like a Nightmare Before Christmas reef. This is a long extension cord here. Is there anything in this? Um, let's see. No, that's empty. There's a Honeywell heater over here. And then this thing. Ugh, get out. That's the only other thing in here besides blank picture frames. I got one, two, three, four, six blank picture frames in here. I think there's only two totes left in the unit. Let's get them. This tote says keepsakes on it, so that's kind of exciting. What are these? Like uh, catcher's pads. Okay. They save their knees. What do you think's in this chest? Pictures. Hmm. Hopefully it's not nothing because it looks brand new. Yeah, nothing oh. again. Man, they got a lot of new stuff. Well, look at this old camera. Is that one of the old, actually old Polaroids or one of the new ones they made them look old? They make so much new stuff nowadays, it's kind of weird, you never know. I see some spoons over here. Are these golden? Look at that, it looks gold to me. It might be actual gold, maybe that's why they saved it. You hear these ducks? Shut up, ducks. Nothing in this bag. This looks like a little baby thing. Uh, a jacket. And that's it, really? I thought the keepsake coat would have something more interesting than that, but no, just basic stuff. Another little tote that was in the corner here. What do we got in here? A curler or a straightener? I can never tell the difference. Curler. Curler. Nothing. Nothing. What is this thing? Uh, whoa, you see the price on it? Yeah. 100 bucks. Hand cast in Britain. I wonder if it's old. What happened? Oh, the top. Look at the tag. That's pretty cool. All right. Well, it looks like there's some other old stuff in here. We got to get in here. This looks interesting. I'm going to put that right here for now. Definitely cool. What's all this other old stuff? Like this. Caliber or Clabber Girl baking, baking powder. powder. How old they is that? They still sell that, but it's not in a metal can. That's old. You could tell. What is that? Jar rings? This is before my time. What is that? More baking powder? Look at this old McCormick stuff down here. Cinnamon. This is old. Pumpkin pie spice. What would it, how much money would it take for you guys watching to taste this? <laughs> you know how old it probably is. Well, it's cool to see. It's definitely like a little time capsule. A little off this side. Oh, there's more of it. Look at that. It's a metal container. Baker's coconut. That's cool. This one, nothing. There's a couple, couple under down here. Look at that. Just super old. And this still in there. Spices. Definitely interesting. Look how closely this is. I don't think we could have fit another dime in the truck. And this is a six foot long bed too. And it's packed to maximum capacity. If you made it all the way to the end of the video, leave a comment saying most insane storage unit ever. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out.